Bagels are will be 40 cents less at Target. Today, the major grocery retailer announced they're cutting prices for thousands of items this summer. WMTV's Marcus Arsvold explains why experts say this is a good thing, but not necessarily a permanent one. Experts say big retailers drop prices by a dollar or 50 cents like this all of the time. I spoke with a UW economist who says customers should take advantage, but also he shares tips on how not to get taken advantage of. If they're getting you in the door because of lower prices on, on staples, they're hoping that you're buying their other goods that may not be uh, such a good deal. UW economist Andrew Stevens says it's great that necessary items like eggs, milk, bread, fruits, and vegetables will be cheaper, but he says these items are not causing inflation right now. Economy. So while inflation is still happening, food is less and less of sort of the big reason behind that. But when you go to the grocery store, you definitely see prices that are higher than you remember a couple of years ago. He says people should take advantage of the deals, but that they should not buy other items at a store just because one item is cheaper. And the more attention you, you pay to your consumption, the more bang you'll get for your buck. Steven says shoppers should continue to look for the best deals, and if they have time, shop at multiple places. So I think if I'm a consumer, I'm thinking about, you know, keeping an eye on coupons. I think I'm thinking about um, what a good substitute might be. If my if my preferred food is getting really expensive, is there something that's not getting as expensive that I could switch to? Target declined an, an interview for today. Live in the studio, Marcus Sarsvold, WMTV 15 News.